السلام عليكم بيس بي ابن يو كونتينيوين اور سيشنز اون قران دين وايل كورنتين ستين هوم فيرسس ستين اون ذا ستريت باث All the governments of the world advises its citizens to stay home. Staying home might save us from coronavirus. While staying on the straight path will lead us to paradise and save us from the hellfire. Do we know what is the straight path? Muslims in their daily obligatory prayers invoke Allah the exalted 17 times to guide them to the straight path Surah Al-Fatiha the opening in the name of Allah the most gracious the most merciful praise be to Allah the cherisher and sustainer of the world most gracious most merciful master of the day of judgment Thy do we worship, and thine aid we seek. Show us the straight way, the way of those on whom thou hast bestowed thy grace. Those whose portion is not wrath, and who go not astray. Indeed, Allah has said the truth. So it is important to constantly supplicate to Allah the Exalted to guide us to the straight path. Because only by the grace of Allah we will be guided. So if we are able to stand in prayer five times a day, it is only by the grace of Allah. If we are able to give our yearly zakat, charity, it is only by the grace of Allah. If we are able to fast the month of Ramadan, it is only by the grace of Allah. If we are able to perform hajj, pilgrimage, once in a lifetime, it is only by the grace of Allah. And if we are able to utter the testimony of faith, I bear witness that there is only one God, Allah, and Muhammad is his last messenger. It is only by the grace of Allah. Muslims believe that is, they were 125,000 messengers were sent by Allah to mankind. Starting from Adam, Noah, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, Joseph, John, David, Solomon, Moses, Jesus, and Muhammad, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. We believe in all of them, those who I mentioned, and those who I did not mention. So if we are able to perform all this, ritual, then we are doing it only by the grace of Allah. So therefore it is very important to invoke Allah constantly to guide us to the straight path. Ibn Umar, may Allah be pleased with him reporting. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, The structure of Islam is built on five pillars. Testification of La ilaha illallah. None has the right to be worshipped but Allah. And that Muhammad, peace be upon him, is his slave and messenger. The establishment of Salat, prayers. The payment of Zakat. Charity, the pilgrimage to the house of Allah in Mecca, and some during the month of Ramadan, fasting. Al Bukhari and Muslims. May Allah guide us to the straight path.
until next time Ramadan Kareem Omar Ahmed Wassalamu alaikum Wassalamu alaikum